Good morning, children. So, in the previous period, we have seen LCM by prime factorization method. Now, today we are going to learn the LCM by common division method. Okay, or you can say the division method. So, LCM by division method. So first is find the LCM of eight, ten, and twelve. Eight. So see children, instead of finding separate factors of 8, 10 and 12 here we will take them common and will divide. See it is very easy. Okay. So whenever the question is asked find the LCM. So you can use this procedure. Okay. It, this method is very easy and quickly you can find the answer. So here I have arranged all the numbers at a time. The same line and Okay, see the numbers are even numbers, and while factorizing, you have to use only the prime numbers. Okay, 2, 3, 7, 11, 13, and so on. Since all numbers are even, or if one of the number even, you can start it by 2. Arranging them 
vertical vertically common all the numbers and then divide got it beta so let's see some more examples second year ke ki 15 and 80 6, 15, and 80. So arrange all vertically properly. Huh? 6, 15, and third one is 80. Huh? Arrange all in one line, and our vertical means we will find the same. See, 6 and 80 are even numbers, so we will start. With two, two, three, sir. You have to divide this number by this. Two divided by six is three, or you can say two three is a six. Yes, fifteen is not divisible by two, so write fifteen as this. Okay. Eighteen divided by two, nine. Okay. Now see what are three, fifteen, and nine. All are the odd numbers. They cannot further divisible by two. So what is the next prime after two? Yes, it is three. So divide three by three. One, three is a one. Fifteen divided by three, five, and three. Ten. One three is a three, five three is a fifty, three three is a nine. Again, we will take three because it has three. One. So write out five as and three ones are. Okay. Now the remainders are one five and one. So we will take the next prime number after this three is five. Okay, so as in first, multiply all these factors. Two into three into three into five. Three is a six. Six is a thirty-six, and thirty-six five is a. You can multiply the. Okay. So you can find the LCM. So let's see one more example, beta. Twelve, eighteen, and twenty-four. Twelve, eighteen, and twenty-four. Again, we will arrange twelve, eighteen, twenty-four. Okay. So here all are the even numbers. So we will start with the fourth and the only even prime number two. Two six six to the twelve. Two nine to the eight, and here twelve. You have to divide this number. Twelve divided by two six. Eighteen divided by two nine. Twenty four divided by two twelve. Okay, so you have to divide all this number by two. So you will get this. Again, we will take two because six and twelve are the even numbers. Two three is a six, and a two three is a six. Nine. So write out nine as it is by because nine is not divisible by two. Two six. Again, we will take two because this 
Six is the even number. Okay. Now write down this three as it is. Three. Write down nine as it is. Why? Because they are not divisible by two. Two. Three is done. Okay. Now six is the three nine three. All are the odd numbers. Okay. So we will not taking these two. Okay. So what is the next prime number after two? Yes, it is three. So we will take three. Three ones are three. Three threes are nine, and three ones are three. So one more three is left. One one. See, all remainders are one. Now multiply all this. So LCM equals to multiply all these factors. Two into two into two into three into three. Two is a four. Two is a two. Two is a twenty-four. And twenty-four three is a seventy-two. Okay. So what is the LCM of twelve, eighteen, and twenty-four? Is seventy. Okay. So let's try to have one more example. So here I am taking twenty four, thirty six, and fifty four. So we have seen this example in the prime factorization method. Okay. Now let us solve this example by common division method. Okay. Arrange properly all the numbers. See, these two are the even numbers. Okay, so we will start two. Twenty-four divided by two is twelve. Or twelve two is twenty-four. Thirty-six. Eighteen is a thirty-six, fifty-four. Two is a four and two seven. That means twenty-seven two is a twenty-four. Or fifty-four divided by two is twenty-seven. Again, these two are the even numbers. So again, we will take two. Two six is a two nine is a twenty-seven is not divisible by two. Okay, so we will write this number as it is. Yes, six is the even number. So again, we will take two, two threes are write down nine as it is. Why? Because nine is not divisible by two, and twenty-seven as it is. Okay, now see children. The remainders are three, nine, twenty-seven. All are the odd numbers. So we will take the next prime number after two is three. Three ones are three. Three threes are nine and nine. Nine threes are so one. Three ones are three. Three threes are. Nine. So this three is left again. See, all the numbers are one. So here we will multiply all these numbers. So LCM equals two. Write all these factors. Two times two. Multiply by three times three. Multiply all two to the four, two to the eight, eight to the twenty-four, twenty-four, three to the seventy-two, three to the. So if you multiply all, you will get two hundred and sixteen. Got it, children? So shall we start one more example? Try one more example. Okay. So 
So in this way, children, you will be able to find the division method, uh, LCM by common division method. And see, beta, it is very easy method. Okay, and you you will get quickly the answer. Okay, just arrange all in one line and divide. Okay, so we will stop over, children. Bye, bye, beta.